I'm Eddie with Hilltop Camper and RV, and today we're going to be looking at a J Flight SLX 7 195. A couple things as you look at the outside here, you'll see that this one does have the option with the fiberglass sides, which is going to be a smooth sided fiberglass here. Up front here, we're going to see a couple things. We're going to see that it's prepped for a side view camera. And on the back, of the, on the back wall of the trailer, we'll also see that it's prepped for a rear view camera. Up front here, you'll see that they've added magnets to hold the baggage door back. Here, we're gonna see a large storage. It'll actually get you access underneath the bed inside. As we come back here, you're gonna notice that you've got a, uh, an electric awning here with the fancy LED light strip. You'll notice that there's two exterior outdoor speakers. Outside here, you've got uh, an external outlet here, so you can plug things into that. As we look to the side here, you're gonna see a Goodyear sticker. All Jayco travel trailers will come with a Goodyear brand tire. Here, we're gonna notice that this is the Jayco 195 RB. As we walk in here, you'll notice a very large closet where you've got hanging space, you've got a shelf, you've got a place to put your shoes, your boots, whatever you may have in there. Next to that, we're gonna find the bathroom where we're gonna find a flush foot stool. We're gonna find a tub shower combo with a skylight for a little more headroom inside there. This particular one is equipped with a six cubic foot RV style refrigerator. So this one will run off propane or electricity. Also above my head here, you will find that you've got a rooftop air conditioner. This is a 13,500 BTU air conditioner, so it's plenty to cool something like this. As I bring that up, in the last two years, uh, the SLX brand has uh, lengthened the ceiling here, or heightened the ceiling. Uh, now it is at six foot six, so you get a little more room, just a little easier to walk around in. Also a big change I made in 2022 is they took the refrigerator from underneath the cabinet and put a full-size refrigerator here. So rather than a, a four cubic foot refrigerator, you've got a six cubic foot refrigerator. Also, they went to a flush mount uh, stove top here, which is still a two burner stove with a glass top and a, a built in backsplash there. And again, flush mount, so you can use, use it as more counter space. Above that, we're gonna find a microwave, a hood fan and hood light. The hood fan will actually exhaust outside, so we'll pull anything outside there. Here we've got kind of a, a two-person dinette that would also double as a, or a bed if you wanted to. The table will drop down and make into a small bed. Over here we've got some overhead compartments for just a little more storage. As you can imagine, in an RV like this, wherever you can put storage, they do. All right, as we look here, you're going to see a couple different uh, deals here. Here you've got a 12 volt outlet, which would be for say a 12 volt TV or an older style cell phone charger. You've got your coax cable with a power boost for the rooftop antenna. Right here, you're gonna find your monitor panel for all your tanks uh, and your battery. So you've got battery level, fresh water tank, black water tank, gray water tank. You've got the controls for your water pump. You've got the water heater controls. So you've got water heater pro uh, gas and you've got water heater electric. So this is equipped with a, a combination water heater. And then you've also got a uh, GFI plug here that you can plug into. This spot would be dedicated for a TV if you wanted to, because here's all your plugs for that. As we look at the bed here, what people love about this floor plan is it's a, it's a walk around camper queen bed. So what a camper queen means is it's 60 wide by 74 long. You've got nightstand on each side and you've got outlet on each side which is huge if you want to plug in your phone, uh, use any kind of a sleep machine. Uh, it's used for many, many different things. You've got overhead lights here. So you've got reading lights there as well. Underneath the bed here, you've got storage that you can also get to from the outside compartment there. Also, you have a curtain to close off the bedroom from the living area here. Last thing here we're gonna have is going to be the radio which is gonna be a Bluetooth radio that you can plug your phone into. You can play the speakers indoor or out. Here you'll notice the sticker on the outside here is the two, two plus three, which is Jayco's warranty. You've got a two year on all the interior components and you've got a three year on the structural component. 
I want to thank you guys today for taking the time to watch this video on the 2022 J-Flight SLX 195RB.